homogenous. Yeah, is that yeah. how you're pronouncing it? No, homogeneous. Exactly. I decided to. I was gonna butcher the <laughs> the, the, the English dictionary <laughs> and change it my way. You wouldn't be the first. If you were. <laughs> I'm sure you won't be the last. Don't no, worry. Now I understand. From that point of view, <laughs> for what I did to that word, I understand the view of some people. Mm. <laughs> some people are against immigration because how can I do that with word? But I think the world is ours. Yes. The world is ours and we have the power to change it. Yes, we do. Mm. And shape it our way. And uh, I did work, took the word homogenous mm. and the, the homogeneous. And then and uh, because, 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 because we are, uh, because we are, as a species, Homo sapiens sapiens, and I decided to say, oh, I'm a new species of person. I am Homo genius. Yeah. And my f the following, because uh, it's a trilogy. Maybe I'm talking. I'm giving you this. This is exclusive. And <laughs> years from now, maybe th ten years from now, we'll be on looking at this moment. Here's a trilogy. Uh, it goes Homo genius. Yeah. It go Homo omni lupus, and it goes. Homo liberus, okay. <laughs> which is like a freedom, and the homo, homo, homo homogeneous is more about the beginning, yes. the process of beginning, the origins of stuff. That's why the first track is called Genesis, and then mm. the fifth track is called, uh, it's called I think from the track list that I have, I have prophecy, and uh, and the second is about is an expression Homo homini lupus is expression. I think it was the Plato the ancient Greece uh, writer who, who said the man is a wolf to another man to his for his where the lupus fitted in uh, yeah lupus is. is the wolf yeah yeah, yeah. Um, um, he loop, um, man is the wolf of for all men so it's about your self-reflection the second album is about self reflection at least that's the concept that i have in mind that's how i'm really a forward thinker mm. i think three five six ten years from now and the uh, so the second album, the second part, this is a theology, is about uh, self-reflection, about the things that you inflict, the, the things that you inflict in ourselves. Because there's this expression that they say, every slave have a, a, a little bit, a percentage of guilt on his own capture. Because I think uh, we are all free, but we choose throughout our life, we make choices that end up leaving us trapped. Where it's mm. trapping a job we don't like, trapping a place we don't like, mm. and that leads to our unhappiness. Yes. Yes. So, is a self reflection about things that I, can, that I did to myself, a person, things that a person can do to yourself. And you, and you have, because you've changed your life. Yes. You've had a journey to come to Norwich, and you've made choices uh, along the way. Along the way. So, wh where were you from originally? I was born in Guinea, West Africa, around Senegal, Guinea Conakry, Gambia, yeah. all those area. Yeah. And then. By 11, I moved to Portugal, where I live. I live six years in Lisbon. Oh. Then I moved late, later on to, after after I finish, I think it's the high school level. It corresponds to the high school. I moved to a college level. I went to the north, in Oporto. That's where I live with my mom. And uh, until I lived there until 2014, mm -hmm. and I moved to England. As uh, I'm not gonna lie, I always wanted to visit England, but as a tourist, but it was the Portugal was going through a recession during that mm. time because mm. when I finished, because I study science, science and technology. Normally, that's how things work in Portugal. After the high school, there's three major areas. There's humanities for people who want to be lawyers and journalists, this kind of stuff, and art. People want to be designers and uh, architects, mm. and uh, then there is science and technology. People want to be engineers. People want to be doctors, nurses. It goes mm. bad. That's the area that I did. So you chose science. Yeah, because like I said, I always wanted to do something. Uh, in whatever I was involved throughout my life, there was always this constant that were always present. I always wanted to do something that make person feel good. When he's writing a lyric, and music and poetry make you feel good, uplift, something uplifting. You see, it's really interesting that you combine both of those things mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. you know, often people are they're interested in science and evidence.